Hey, how's it going? Charlie here. Uh, Gene and I are here on location in Isor Kiro, um, Finland, at the Kiro, Kiro Distillery. We've learned we've been pronouncing it wrong the whole time. It's not Cairo, it's Kiro. Um, kind of roll your R's, I guess. But we are live here on location. Not live, but we're here on location uh, here at the Kiro uh, Distillery. Uh, we are lucky enough and blessed enough to have Miko, uh, one of the founders of Kiro Distillery. Hi, I'm Miko. Co-founder with these friends of Kura Distillery Finland. We've been talking with him for a while. We've made it here to Finland. He's given us a private tour of the distillery. We're staying here on campus. They cannot be better hosts. Freaking phenomenal. We're gonna have dinner here. We're gonna have some drinks. We're gonna have a good time. We got some behind the scenes knowledge of some upcoming uh, rye endeavors, we'll say. But let's go check out the distillery. Let me give you a quick tour and we'll talk about what we thought of the distillery. Gene, would you like a dram? Yes, I would. Hey, thanks yes, for I would. tuning in to uh, Multicasting Special Edition. I'm Charlie. I'm Gene. And uh, appreciate your subscription to the channel. Thumbs up if you like us, thumbs down if you don't. This is a special edition. Why is it so special, Gene? Well, because we are going to just sit here and chitter chat, really. We're not going to review this whiskey because we've already reviewed it. But we're just going to tell you about our trip. But you know what we're going to do? We're going to review the um, outstanding awesomeness is that is Kiro. 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 Mm -hmm. Kiro, like we say, we pronounce it Cairo, but the Kiro Distillery. Yep. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. Has, we've been to what, 25, 30 or more distilleries. Easily the best ever. Do you disagree? No, I don't disagree at all. Because you're an intelligent woman. Uh, so we went to Finland. Um, boy, I tell you, I was, <laughs> I was like, Finland? Why would we want to go to Finland in the winter time? Who would want to do that? Arctic Circle in December, yes. <laughs> well, we did, and I'd yeah. do it again. I would do it again in a heartbeat. It was way more fun than I thought it was going to be. It awesome. snowed almost every day we were there. It was like walking in a snow globe. It was awesome. It was really cold, but we had snow pants, and we, we uh, prepared for it. So uh, we were well dressed. Yeah. Pre prepared for it is what I tell you. So it didn't over feel that cold. For yeah, it. over. Uh, overpacked. I was actually sweating so much. I had so many layers on. <laughs> okay. I tell you. Okay, you tell me. I tell you. Uh, so we got a hold of Miko, who you may know from this extremely famous uh, YouTube whiskey commercial. Where it's a bunch of grown men naked talking whiskey, as they should be. Why would you not? Why would you have clothes on talking about whiskey? Oh, well, I'm gonna I'm gonna show the actual. I know, but I just want you to see our, our oh, coasters yeah. we got. Metal coasters. I appreciate them not being plastic. Miko's yes. one of those. That's all I can tell you. I don't know which one. We said, hey Miko, which about yours? He goes, one of them. He said, I'm on there. Well played. <laughs> so we went. To, we'll show some footage here of us in um, at the distillery. Mm -hmm. uh, it's an amazing distillery. Um, there in Iso Kiro, uh, which is what Kiro Distillery is named after. Mm -hmm. So here's some footage of that. Okay, so here's the main uh, tourist building. The inside here, they have the old uh, distillate, uh, old uh, distillery in here, the old barrels, the old old things. But they also have the new bottling area in here. They have the gift shop area, the tour, tourist area in here. They have the restaurant in here, and over here. That's where the new whiskey's made. They have, uh, they design it for tours. You can walk above the vats and you can walk above into the ferment fermentation area. You can walk above all that. See all neat, neat and cool stuff? All right, so behind me is the fermentation room, the new fermentation room with the copper pot stills and the vats and everything. It smells wonderful right now. I can get the, the smell of malt like it's the fermentation room. But the smell here is just amazing. If you've never been in a fermentation room, take a distillery tour. It smells amazing. These are brand new copper pot stills in here. Um, this is a first rate state of the art facility here. Uh, we had a we had a gourmet meal and when oh. I say gourmet. <laughs> Thing. This is where we're going to have dinner tonight. Uh, super neat inside. We've been, Gene and I have been to a ton of distilleries. 
I'm gonna be honest with you, distilleries, not all of you have a great visitor center like they do here. It's freaking phenomenal. Uh, we're gonna have dinner here with some Finnish folks tonight and uh, enjoy the, the culture and the experience of it all. It was the best meal that I have had in a long time, hands down, either in Finland or in the States, just oh, either. Yeah. That was the best meal. It was perfectly cooked. Uh, the chef's name is... Saya, I believe. Saya, I believe. Yeah, we'll spell it. Yeah, spell it. I believe it's Saya, but yeah, great, great, great gal. Uh, friendly as heck. We visited her with after, after the meal for a while. Mm -hmm. Turns out she was in our neck of the woods not too long ago with her husband. We, so we said, hey, if you're ever in town, and if you're ever in town, look us up. Absolutely. Heck Absolutely. yeah, we'll show you the, show you the works. Um, but they said, ah, oh, it's a three-course meal. <laughs> they bring it to you a Thanksgiving style type of thing yes. where, where they just bring the, the dishes and you serve off of the dishes. First course was six different things. <laughs> there was a lot of food. It was amazing. Uh, yeah, they, 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 they put us up uh, at the distillery. We stayed in their distillery house. Mm -hmm. We had our own private sauna. We jumped up in some snow house. angels. Yeah, the key row house. Yep. Uh, Miko is a uh, historian as well as an entrepreneur. It was a wonderful tour that he gave us. Um, talked about a battle that had happened right nearby. Um, yeah, you're thousands of years ago. You're standing on this bridge and he's just painting the picture. He's like, it happened right over here around that curve. And mm -hmm. It was just amazing. You can testify that while we were fighting in this field, we had never shed an inch from the duty and the love for the country. But we fell to the very last, uh, to the places where we were standing, to the very last man, leaving the dutiful example as a heritage to stand on harsh times for the country as we did in this field. And if necessary, to die to the very last man as we did in this field. Just amazing. Everything about it was awesome. The people were awesome. Uh, the, the, the employees there were awesome. Mm -hmm. The townsfolk were awesome. I think the- Mika was awesome, red carpet. The lady's name enough, so. that waited on us, I think, was Ida. Eva. Oh, Eva? I thought it was Ida. We're going to say Ida. I didn't want to interrupt her, but that's Ida over there. She is an amazing uh, employee here at Kiro. Uh, she's in charge of the restaurant and all that kind of good stuff, and she's giving the tour today in Finnish only. I don't speak Finnish, but it's a great language. But I didn't want to interrupt her over there filming while she's over there talking. She was from, so she was talking about the differences between uh, Western Finland and, and Eastern oh, yeah. Finland. Yeah, and she yeah. was saying that there were really quite a bunch of differences between the two. We didn't go to the Eastern side. We stayed over on the Western side. Yep. And we also uh, ran into this gentleman, who you know from this very famous uh, Kiro commercial where he has a hog and he's picking some uh, berries to put inside of his uh, gin. Because Kiro makes gin. And we tasted that drink. It is yes. amazing. We got to taste all of the gins, all of the uh, whiskeys. All the whiskeys. It was all just, the liquors. If they had it, we tasted it. The, yep, awesome. it's good. Good stuff. Uh, surprisingly, that drink was very refreshing. Did you get refreshed? Refreshing. Refreshing. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm, I'm a rye guy, so I was there for the rye. Uh, they have so, a peated rye. They have a smoked rye. Not yet made it to the States. Looking forward to that. When that comes out, we'll do an official review of that. Uh, but yeah, just so many cool things. Uh, thank you so much to Miko, uh, to everybody there who just could have been nicer. Yeah. Could have been nicer. Um, and if we're ever back in that neck of the woods, if you're in that neck of the woods, freaking go to Kiro. Absolutely. Oh my you goodness. You need to go there. It's just an amazing experience. Beautiful, beautiful distillery. Mm -hmm. uh, anything left to add, Jean? Boy, I tell you, I don't, I'm trying to think. Would you like that, for me to put some fo that's... footage in here of your snow angels or my snow angels? Your snow angels. What? My snow angels, no. Let's go. Straight from the sauna, or sauna, because <laughs> American mispronounces it. Sauna. Straight from the sauna, into the snow, American style. Anything left to add, Jean? No, that was it. Uh, I'm Charlie. I'm Jean. Thank you, I, Miko. I hope you are just as thirsty as we are. Ha, 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 ha.